Hi guys, Neil Waterhouse. This week's video is a step-by-step -step showing how to add variations in your eBay listings. Now just so we're on the same page, here's an example of a multi-variation eBay listing selling t-shirts. Notice that with this multi-variation listing, you can select the size and the colour of the t-shirts. That is our eBay multi-variation listing and this video shows how to set that up. Okay, let's get started. For this example, I'll create a new listing and to do that, click on the sell button at the top of any page on eBay. Then create listing, then single listing, then search for the correct category for whatever you're gonna list. For this example, I'll choose men's t-shirts. Now, as I type, eBay automatically shows what it believes to be the relevant category. In this case, eBay got it right, and I selected the men's t-shirt category. Now, eBay takes me to the listing description page where you enter all the details about the item that you're selling. Notice on this page, there's a variations button. Now, if you're not seeing the variations button, this is normally because of one of two reasons. The first reason is you must have an eBay store for the variations button to show. If you don't currently have an eBay store, the variations button will not show. Now, if you don't have an eBay store, but you'd like to know how to set up an eBay store, I'll put a link on the screen and below to a free video showing how to set up an eBay store. The other reason the variations button may not be showing is variations only work with fixed price listings. Multi-variation listings do not work with auction listings. If you scroll down this same page, there's a box where you can select fixed price for the listing that you're doing, or auction. So if you're planning to do a multi-variation listing, select fixed price. Okay, so hopefully your create variations button is now showing. Next step is to click that create variations button. On this page, choose which sizes you have and the material and it's also the add button so you can add any other attribute that you'd like. For this example I'll add the attribute colour. Next it's just a matter of clicking on whichever variations suit the item that you're listing. For this example I'll click on small, medium and large. Notice that once you click on whichever option you choose those options instantly show on the right hand side. Next I'll click on the colour attribute and then select black, red and white options. Notice again that the, these options are now showing on the right hand side. Once you've finished adding attributes and options, click on the blue continue button. Next upload your photos, just like you would do with any other non-multivariation listing. Next, you can allocate a photo for each option. So when a buyer selects, say, a black t-shirt, eBay displays a black t-shirt. Now if you scroll down, you'll see all the different variations that you've created. Here you can add your price for each variation, and you can also add the quantity, and also, if you don't have any of these variations, or you're not missing one or two or more of the variations that eBay's showing you now, you can delete any variation that you don't have. Also, if you use a program like Scarcity Manager to check your supplier's inventory levels, you'll need to add a SKU number to each variation for Scarcity Manager to work. The SKU number can be anything, but just make sure the, each SKU number for each variation is different. After you've done that, click on the blue Save and Close button. The next steps are just like populating any other non-multivariation eBay listing, i.e. You know, title, title description, shipping, optimization, etc. I'm not going to go into those fields in this video as I've done that many times before, but if you're not sure how to populate and optimise those fields, I'll put a link on the screen and below to another free video showing you how you can do this. Hope this helped with showing you how to add variations to your eBay listings. That's all for this week. Please scroll down and leave me a comment below. And while you're there, make sure you hit the subscribe button for more hints, tips and automation strategies to make money on eBay and Amazon without leaving the comfort of your own home. Until next week, stay safe, list more, sell more. This is Neil Waterhouse.